Hi everyone and welcome to Sports Center live from the ESPN Studios in Los Angeles. I'm David McAtee alongside Aiden Beversdorf. We are a mere three hours away from NBA Finals Game Three, featuring the Boston Celtics and the Golden State Warriors. So, Aiden, how, where do you have this series going? Um, I think I have the Celtics winning it six or seven. It's a pretty evenly matched series. Uh, so far, it's played out. It's been two pretty lopsided games um, towards the end of the game, but I really can see the Celtics pulling it away. That's a good take. I have the Golden State Warriors, I think, in six. I think the Golden State Warriors will steal one on the road. They'll go back to Chase Center. They'll win it there, and I think they'll close it out in six. I feel like this. I feel like the – oh, it looks like we have breaking news coming in. Wow. Marcus Smart will be out for game three of the calf injury. Aiden, how do you think this is going to affect the series and game three? This is going to affect Celtics' defense a whole lot and Defensive Player of the Year. Big reason for why they're even in the finals. Um, the other players are going to have to step up a whole lot more to even be close to winning this game. I agree. I think it's going to make it a lot easier on the Warriors. I think that Marcus Smart really tried to guard Kerr in the other games, and the Warriors did all they could to get him off of him. This is going to be a big burden lift off, lifted off their shoulders for the Warriors. Curry can just go to work and not have to worry about going against the reigning Defensive Player of the Year. So I think this is a major loss for the Boston Celtics. Well, all right, that'll do it from the ESPN Studios in Los Angeles. I'm David McAtee alongside Aiden Beversdorf, and that's it.